up y'all welcome to my video i finally figured out how to mess with all these like audio settings and stuff so we're here we made it we made it that's all that matters right that we're here welcome to my island welcome to my island all right so let me clap for myself because we did it we did this you know all right so first things first i kept my island pretty natural let's go through my map i kept my island pretty natural meaning like i kept the rivers where they are and uh, i'm still figuring out how exactly i want to terraform everything but uh you guys will see why i have so many dirt paths laid out uh, i'm gonna explain that a little bit later these are my residents right here i got hippo he's cool at first like i didn't really want him on my island oh i should also mention that my island is like completely natural meaning like uh, i kept all of the initial like residents like i haven't kicked anybody out i don't do time traveling and stuff like that i really just like enjoy going at the pace of the game if that makes sense because you know i got like I got like real life things that I got to do too and I, I kind of like coming into my game and then being excited about the new developments and stuff like that you feel me like I, I like to be a little bit like less in control when it comes to this game because I got to control hella shit outside my life all right we're not gonna get that deep we're not gonna get too deep anyways moving on all right so here's Astrid she's cool she got a little baby you see her she like a kangaroo and shit she got like everything like a little playground themey you know what I'm talking about Billy Billy is cool he's high all the time he's high all the time and he wait he works out a lot and I'm just like how do you do anyways he reminds me of one of my homies which is kind of cool you know uh Mira this is my this is my ride or die like she been she been here she's the first one you know since the beginning um this is Monty he's like the resident that I feel like the least connected with out of all of my residents but I just think it's because like he like he got like a grumpy old like personality and he'd be he'd be like slow to walk and stuff I mean it's all good you know what I mean it's all good uh he just probably like doesn't mesh with my personality uh Cole uh the only reason why I put Cole so far apart from everybody else is because like I didn't want to put Cole in in the in like t the houses to the left and feel hella like overcrowded in that space you know what I mean I did not try to segregate Cole all right putting it out there spork Spork is my favorite resident only because he reminds me of my uncle you know what i mean like he they got the same habits it's hella weird my uncle that passed away recently um and then and then his character came along and i'm just like this is way too this is way too freaky i need to keep him so at all costs he is staying here and he's my uncle resident uh poppy yeah this is my girl she's so cute you know she dressed like a little cute you know like she'd be having her little reading moments under a tree you know what i'm talking about she she like uh she'd be falling asleep under the tree sometimes but it's okay a uh, broccolo is tight he just he or she just mind mind their own business but be hella uppity the broccolo broccolo that person that you need to bring vibes up you know uh and then paid paid school paid school i don't know anyways welcome to duck soup <laughs> this is my island called duck soup and so my island is philippines themed i don't know if you guys can see this here this is like uh this is a custom a custom design by an artist i'll leave their info in the bio and stuff but i, w I really wanted to have uh, a railroad in front of my house because there's this show in the philippines called home along the reeless home along the reeless if you are older than 20 years old and you probably like lived in the philippines or something you probably watched it, seen this on tv on like reruns or something it's like really it's a big part of your childhood bro so this is my house right here i needed my home along the realas you feel me um and i have like a dirt path all around right here because like since my island is philippines themed i'm like trying to make it look as like authentic as possible not everywhere in the philippines is like dumbass rural where it's like all dirt and shit you know what i mean but like this is what i remember the philippines being when i lived there like i think it's like 15 years ago now you know it wasn't as developed this is what i remember all right this one makes me happy and i have a little you know i got like a little barbecue moment here i got like a little a little chill a little chill let me lay down kind of moment um, we're gonna save my house for the end though just to let you guys know and then you know I really like the look of this a utility pole we're gonna cross over this ways so just to let you guys know this is the second time I recorded because the first time I was just way too excited and disorganized so I was like I need to collect my thoughts you know what I mean this is just a little play area 
Nothing, nothing too fancy here. My little cabin area. And, oh, here are my residents. So when uh, Tom Nook asked me to arrange, like, their houses and stuff, I tried to make sure that they had, like, you know, sufficient space, but also I kind of wanted them to look organized. I live in condos, so this is my image of home. You know what I mean? And then, uh, oh, also, I've kept most of the natural terraform or, like, the landscaping. I only did major terraforming in this area right here. So, uh, welcome to my little zen, my little zen area slash resort moment, you know, put the hearth right there for the vibes, you know. Um, I like to keep the rocks in my area too. They add like a little aesthetic and then I can like grab resources and stuff from them. And then, so I was thinking about spacing out the bamboo and like the lights and stuff like that, but I kind of like how it looks like the light is coming from under the bamboo, you feel me, at night, you know what I mean? Um, I like to keep the weeds too, obviously. Welcome to my bath. All right, we're about to sit down. We're about to relax. Relax and chill out. We're going to take a picture. We're going to say, hey, we're here. We're present. You know what I'm talking about? Um, I customized the bath to the white, the white coloring thing thing. Oh, and as you guys can see in the back over there, I kept one of my rocks. I'm kind of sad, though, that's like back there. I didn't think about like, oh, I can't get resources from it. But also like for the vibes, bro, uh, we're going to go and we're going to go around here. Uh, I forgot to mention that my island is a four star island. I, I do want to get it to five stars, but it's not that serious right now. Um, I'm, I'm rather like having fun with it and seeing what I like to decorate and all that. Oh, my first pink lily. I love her. She's beautiful. And yeah, I just felt like decorating the side to make it a little cute cute. Um, I love having these clam beds by the ocean. Because like imagine, isn't this like bad bitch energy? Like, let me go fuck with my clam bed by the ocean. I showed my mom this and then she made the sound like doom. My mom was like, oh my god, her bed is so hard. I'm like, yeah, I know. Uh, we're just going to go around here. Nothing to see here. I plan on maybe making like a soccer stadium or something in the near future. I do want to make a market area. Have like some little sadie sadi stories, you know. Oh, I forgot that I put Stonehenge over there. Um, let's, let's hop this ways, that ways. So I have those like little, like the little hoppity things, you know, because I'm like... Like, who, who really trying to go here and pull up their vaulting pole every single time? Like, no, I do not want to do that. I already have to do that to shovel and to climb and pull out my ladder. Like, anyways, we better go look at my garden. Look at my garden. She's beautiful, right? You know what I'm talking about? I was trying to, like, make blank spaces to for, like, hybrid flowers and stuff, but I was like... I don't know, I just didn't like how empty it looked. And I'm just like, well, hybrid flowers will pop up how they will, you know? As you can see, apples are my favorite fruit. They just look like way more vibrant than the cherries. Like, bro, like, why are you looking hella bright over here? But then over here, you're looking like kind of ashy or whatever, you know what I mean? Like, if they had, if like the animators or the game developers made them to look equally as vibrant, I feel like I would have loved the cherries more uh, just because of like their cherries, you know? They look like little like juicy fruits and stuff. But it is what it is. I love the apples. Oh, I put all my money trees right here. That's why they all like grow in hella random and shit. Oh, I got lost in my own forest. What's a good boo? I forgot what his name is. Anyways, I'm gonna go fuck with him later because I got shit to do. Alright. This is my homie Cole's house. You like how I be talking about like my neighbors like they're my actual friends. Uh, they're really cool. And... Welcome to my cemetery. I don't know why I want to do that. Um, this is my Lola and my Lola. I say hi to them every time I come into the game. And I wish I could like... I mean, I, I might end up designing something that has like their names on the bottom of the tombstones and stuff like that. But we're going to imagine that you can see it. Um, and then over here, uh, I custom colored... Uh, customized or whatever this little basket uh, I like the contrast of the darker wood I like how shiny it is you know I do plan on like making all of this stuff look better this is just me showing you guys like what it looks like right now 
you'll probably see that as like time goes on and I make more videos. Oh, I got another clam bed. You know, when I told you guys that I love my clam bed, like I am not playing. Anyways. Yeah, it took, like, you don't know how long it took me to find enough clams to make the first clam bed. And I was like, I am never, ever taking advantage of that fact. Oh, okay, so I made, like, a little kick it play area. Got, like, you know, she got, like, a little hammock here, whatever. Um, and then, so, the, the funny thing is, is that when I got this, uh, this, this neighbor or resident, Astrid, that's when I really started thinking about like, okay, like she got a kid. I got to start putting more kids stuff around. You know what I mean? Because before that, I didn't really like think about it. Um, I think, oh, also last thing before we go to my house, I think it's kind of obvious that I have able sisters right there. This is, it's like you come to my island shopping district already in front of you. Then you can go explore. You know what I'm talking about? Especially if I'm trying to like run all these missions and stuff. Like I want everything by my house and then I can go have like a big old playground and stuff. <laughs> All right, welcome. Welcome to my crib. You like the music? Um, yeah, so I'm real. I don't know if you can tell, but I have phases in my life where I am obsessed with a certain color. Can you tell what it is? Can you tell? Um, yeah, so. Uh, it's really important to me to at least keep some things in my crib that are from the homies and stuff, you know, so like I got that snow globe right there and like a protein powder. Um, and it's just for the vibes, you know, like I love, I love this, how you can just like on this like flooring. I love this flooring. You can just like, I can just like step on it like a puddle, you know what I mean? It makes a little sound and stuff. Um, but yeah, a little kitchen moment. And where should we go first? Oh, let's save my bedroom for last. Let's let's go to the room that I don't like the most first. Um, I like all my rooms, but this one's just the one that like I haven't spent too much time on. It's just a workout room. It feels like the garage, you know. You got like workout equipment. You got like the toolbox, cleaning stuff. You know what I'm talking about? You got the scale for if you need to serve somebody. The little sack right there. You feel me? Uh, nothing too special. You know, I gotta have the money rug. Remind me that, you know, hustle don't stop. <laughs> Billionaire. All right. Let's go to my library. So yeah, here is my library. I just got this flooring the other day and oh my god, I love this. I used to have like the pink camo flooring with this setup, but this just makes it feel like real, real, real expensive, like real, real, real regal type, you know, like, oh, and also, <laughs> anyways, um, this is, this is a room that I wish I had in real life, you know, just like feels real, real ancient, real museum like. You know what I mean? All my achievements up there, you feel me? In real life, those would be degrees, because we're out here. Um, There's actually no reason why I have more fish than I do insects. Um, all, Well, I do have the snail, because the snail is actually, like, my favorite insect in, like, real life. But uh, I just don't like how the insects display and their their little cage thing is colored, you know? I feel like it's like green or blue or something like that. Like the, the fish have like real, real nice um, like cases. They're just like black, super neutral and match with everything. And, you know, they give that like deep vibes, you know? Anyways, let's go to my bedroom. That's my favorite room. I love how I'm like slapping in every different room, you know, like that's something that I wish I could do in real life without running up the electric bill. All right, so here is my room. She like real quiet vibes, real like sleepy, real, I'm ready to rest and relax and you know what I'm talking about? Uh, yeah. 
I love my clan bed, like I said earlier. And this is it, just real simple, real chill. I got my diffuser, you feel me? I got that from my homie. Real nice. All right, so that basically concludes my island, and I hope you I hope you really appreciated it. I should say I really appreciated being able to finally, you know, put this video together and figure out all the audio stuff, and I'm gonna put this away. And you know, maybe in the future, I'm gonna do videos of each one of my uh, residence houses. I think that would be cool because they all have like cool little personalities associated with it. Um, I'm, maybe I can show you guys the improvements, or I can like do like a little tips video on what what I do every day to kind of just like keep up with everything. Um, but yeah, like if there's anything else that you guys want to see. Uh, yeah please let me know i hope you really liked it uh i just realized right now that i didn't show you guys one part of uh, my island but it's all good more to come more to come so how do we do this that's my goodbye my goodbye to y'all <laughs>